Nam the canon alleges that Osibajo and Adishino are sick and dying of COVID-19. Following the death of Abakiari, Wari's chief of staff, Mazikanu, has alleged that Osibajo and Femi Adishino also is sick and dying of COVID-19. The government of Photoshop is gone forever. They are prepared to bury the ashes of Abakiari this morning in Abuja. Let it be known that, contrary to the government directives, Abakiari's body was tremulated in Cuba upon being pronounced dead two weeks ago when his life support machine was switched off. Impovi impoverished, hungry, and angry masses in the north must cut off the escape routes of coronavirus infection. Buratai, who has fled Nigeria through land border into Niger Republic while letting confused gullible Nigerians that he is in Bonu fighting Boko Haram and won't return until he has defeated them. He knows he is no longer coming back. Yoruba Nation, your son Yemi Osibaju is very sick and dying from coronavirus infection he got from Abakari. Femi Adeshino also is sick and dying of coronavirus. The main office of the presidential is locked and inaccessible because only the biometrics data of Abakari can open it. Now, all they brought back was Abakari's arches. The Chinese they brought are working to dismantle the bomb proof door proofs. Wow, viewers. Thank you for listening to this short news about Bakari and Namdi Kanu telling uh, the Nigerians that Osibaju and Adishino are also on the sick bed. This is the same thing Namdi Kanu told us about Abakiara, but nobody ever believed what he said. Inambi Khan is a man that doesn't eat, see things because he wants to see it. He says things with proof and evidence. He doesn't see, doesn't talk anyhow. He is always conscious of what he says because he doesn't want to offend God. But whenever he says anything, it's always, oh, you always get the facts before announcing it out to the public. That is why Biafrans trust and support everything he says. Imagine, he said that before, but nobody believed it. My prayer is that God in heaven will remove everyone that is responsible for the suffering of the masses in Nigeria in Jesus' name. Great Mazikan. He kept telling Nigerians the truth, but we refused to listen and hear the truth. They said the truth might is bitter. That is what an adage says, and truly is bitter. When someone tells you the truth, we don't believe that person until that thing comes to manifestation. He kept on, kept on telling us the truth, but to some people, he's saying rubbish. He's talking rubbish. He, he told Nigerians about Abakiari. They did not believe him, but now it is true. Now, he has made another serious revelations that some brainless people will call his names but don't mind him they might call him names for this new revelation that he has given but he doesn't care no matter what he called him 
he says that he will keep saying, telling the truth. It not, he's not trying to criticize or wish anybody evil or death. But he says as things are. They will call him names from saying all this. But he will not mind them. He will keep saying it. At the end of the day, truth must surely prevail. So now that he, what he said about Abakari has come to manifestation, what those that are still not believing what he says, would they keep, would they not believe or still doubt, doubt him? Because Nigerians, as I've said before, that they are doubting Thomas. Those that are eating and becoming for no just cause and making mistakes. Those that don't wish Nambi Kanu well or Biafran to gain its republic are making huge mistakes. It's better for you to embrace and support Nambi Kanu for his good deeds. He doesn't want the um the uh, he doesn't want Nigeria to be mocked. He doesn't want Nigeria to be put to shame. That is why he's making all these efforts that he's making to make sure that Nigeria is at peace. Nigeria um, survives this crisis and calamities happening in the country. Nabi Kanu is absolutely right. For everything he has said and everything he says and everything he will keep saying, even the impostor is nowhere to be found. The impostor Buari is not yet to be found. Now, he is supposed to say something about Abakari. Look at Abakari died yesterday. A lot of people have been commending. A lot of people have been sending messages, condolence messages to the family. A lot of people have been reacting to the death of Abakari. But Buari has not said anything yet about this because he's an impostor. Someone that, a, a leader that, um, something like this came into your country. Coronavirus came to your country and you were not able to address your citizens. Is that not a shame? You have not opened your mouth to address your citizens' life or via television broadcast or a radio broadcast. What you do is a recorded, is to post your, 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 a, Publishers, they post fake voice of former Buhari. That you, Jubril, is Buhari. Which is so, so, so annoying. If truly you are Buhari, come out and address. This time that Abakari is dead, your chief of staff is dead. You were unable, you can't even come out and address the world. Or con send a condolence message to his family. This is so shameful. This is so shameful. This is unacceptable. That is it. It's not acceptable. So they said they want to arrest Kanu because he is saying the truth. Arresting Kanu is not the important thing to do. Because he's not a criminal nor a traitor. Is a man that speaks the truth and he says no matter what he will continue to speak the truth even if he's been arrested where he is he will keep saying the truth he comes out he will keep saying the truth so why arrest him so viewers this is what i have to say concerning this concerning the statement made by namdi khan and for him revealing the truth about those people. It said, it told us about Abakari. And now we're seeing that it, it, it's true. He now is telling us about um, Osibaju and Adishin. It's not left for us to believe what he's saying or not. But I know that with what he said, we'll definitely see the truth very soon. But we are not wishing them death, but a quick recovery. So viewers, what is your take on this that you just heard? If you have any comments or any contributions, don't hesitate to drop them below the comment box. Click on the subscribe button as well as the bell button to receive 
notifications or updates whenever I publish new videos. And don't forget, share and like this news as well. Thank you.